In 1930, a site for a new Travis County courthouse was selected adjacent to the north end of Wildridge Park at the intersection of 10th and Guadalupe Streets. The cornerstone was laid in 1930, and the courthouse was completed the following year. The structure was built to house all county offices, with the top two floors used as the county jail. Designed in the modern style by Page Brothers Architects and built by H.E. Wattinger Contractors, the 1931 courthouse broke with the classical design elements of the past. As originally designed and built, the courthouse was a refined, symmetrical building with bronze entrance doors on all four sides. By the 1950s, however, the county was already outgrowing the courthouse. More space was needed, so significant additions were constructed in 1958 and again in 1962. The main entrance at the east end of the second floor has since been closed due to security needs, as has the entrance facing Wildridge Park. As more courtrooms have been crowded into the building, one of the original main courtrooms has lost its high ceiling. But the hope remains to preserve and restore the courthouse as a significant piece of architecture and as a focal point for the life of the community. In March of 2005, a plaque was installed outside the Travis County Courthouse in honor of Heman Marion Sweat, a civil rights pioneer who successfully challenged the policy of segregation at the University of Texas Law School. On October 21, 2005, Travis County held a ceremony to rename the courthouse as the Heman Marion Sweat Travis County Courthouse. For information on the many historical markers found in Travis County, visit the Texas Historical Commission's Texas Historic Sites Atlas website. Located at atlas.thc.state.tx.us.